Hi, it's uh, Nick from Pickleball's Life. Uh, we're going to replace the grip on a Paddletech uh, Gamma Pickleball uh, High Tech Gel Grip. Wrap it like that. Welcome to Pickleball is Life. If you like these videos, please subscribe and share them with your friends. And how about you press that little like button? Thanks. And check out my Pickleball is Life shirts, hats, and sport towels at the end of this video. Hi, it's uh, Nick from Pickleball is Life. Uh, we're going to replace the grip on a Paddletech uh, paddle. Uh, there are two options. You can either put an over grip, which is a real thin grip on top of your existing grip, or you can actually replace take off the existing grip and put a whole new grip on. That's what we're going to do today. I have the Gamma Pickleball uh, High Tech Gel Grip that we're going to use. So uh, let's first take off the existing uh, grip. There's a uh, wrap at the top that you want to find the edge on to simply pull that uh, wrap off here. That comes off real easy. And then you can find the spot where the grip was finished wrapping and start undoing that. Oh, there's actually some, looks like there's some tape uh, on the end of the grip wrap that was cut right here. So this is just some extra tape, looks like almost uh, um, electrical tape and then you unwrap it like that and it ends like that so you're left with the bare grip and the uh, tape to finish it now um, if you want to uh, increase the thickness of your grip you can put some like duct tape uh, up and down on the handle uh, prior to putting the new grip on and that will get you a little bit more thickness uh, in your grip otherwise just put the replacement grip right on top of the bare wood and plastic. So let's open up the new Gamma grip and uh, we have the, fi the finishing tape at the uh, at the beginning or uh, holding it together so this will be the finishing tape that we're going to use so save this don't throw this away and then uh, we'll open up the package of the new grip it's got like a cellophane liner that is used to just keep it uh, together and then this is the new grip you're gonna start with the end that is sort of to a point and we may need to trim uh, and cut a slant on the other end now this is the gel grip so you can feel it's got some um, thickness to it and play um, and the there's a cover to um, uh, there's a cover that covers up the um, sticky part of the grip so just pull a little piece of it uh, down to, to uh, expose this sticky side start from the end of the grip and uh, I usually recommend putting the first little section across the long section of the grip right there and pull 
the grip material away as you wrap it around the handle. And then you have to keep pulling this off to expose the sticky section. And then at some point, it will start moving. Uh, you start moving it at an angle to wrap around the grip. So we can probably pull all of this off now. And you basically want to stay at the same angle as you're going. I'm just going to follow the line uh, of the grip material, pulling taunt at all times so that you don't get any um, bubbles or loose sections. Just follow it. There's like a line that you can just follow. Again, I'm pulling away and pulling the grip material so that it's real tight as I'm wrapping. Now, once we get near the end here, we need to cut um, this way from the top down to here to be able to uh, finish uh, the wrap clean and square. So you get close to the top and then you come straight from the top uh, through with a pair of scissors. So we're simply going to position it like that and cut like that on that angle. Hopefully you can see that. Like that, get my start. And just cut so it's a little tricky to decide how far out you can go further out or for, uh, for uh, closer in, but you want to create that, that angle like that. Um, and that is your last few wraps uh, around the um, end of the paddle. And then once you have it uh, fully to the top, you take um, this little gamma uh, label and you can start it somewhere and pull off the rest of the sticky tape. So we've got a backing. A little tricky to get off. Take the backing off of that tape. This sort of acts like electrical tape. And you can, again, keeping it taut. Put the final wrap around to create the top seal. And there we go. One new grip on the paddle deck. So um, need to be careful when wrapping to pull real tight so that you don't get any bubbles or perforations in the grip material uh, as it's um, coming going up the uh, handle. And then uh, make sure you uh, allow, uh, you, you wrap the top uh, completely before you make that cut because uh, you can cut it too short and then um, sometimes you need a little extra uh, like when I took off this old grip I noticed there was some black tape 
Um, so sometimes you can use electrical tape to finish the top uh, nice and tight and snug before you put that little uh, wrap on that they give you. That little cover wrap, the gamma cover wrap, is really just for show almost. It's not um, the greatest uh, uh, material to hold the top in. So I actually put on, I reuse some of the um, extra tape, look like electrical tape, uh, on the top here just to hold it a little tighter. And then I put the gamma um, simple uh, tape on. But it uh, looks like a good job, and uh, we'll give it a try. Hey, don't forget to check out my pickleball shirts and hats uh, that are uh, available online at Etsy. Thanks, everyone. Bye-bye. Hey everyone, it's uh, Nick from Pickleball's Life, and we are going to replace the um, Hi, it's uh, Nick from Pickleball's Life. Uh, we're going to today. Hey, if you like this video and want to help support my Pickleball channel, we have Pickleball is Life t-shirts available in both v-neck and crew cut, in both dry fit and cotton, with sleeves, sleeveless, and women's racerbacks. I just got in new A4 blocked shirts with stripes down the side, and I'm putting five Pickleballs on the back of all the shirts. I also have Pickleball is Life hats and sport towels. You can buy them from me on the court or online at Etsy. <laughs> hey, thanks for watching. If you like this video, all I ask is that you please subscribe by clicking on the top left and share this video with your friends. If you want to see some other pickleball videos, they're here in the center. My other YouTube channel, Tesla Life, is on the bottom left. Check it out. My Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter accounts are listed on the right. Thanks, everyone. Bye-bye.